Fuel pressure regulator test. Disconnect the pressure regulator connector. Disconnect the diesel temperature sensor connector. Disconnect the electric connector on injector number 3 and the glow plug connector. Remove the fuel pipe's holder bolts. Remove the high pressure pipe on injector number 4. Remove the dipstick. Use a torque spit to remove the pressure regulator bolts. Remove the pressure regulator bolts. Access to the second screw is facilitated by removing the high pressure pipe on injector number 3. Remove the pressure regulator. If the pump is not blocked, fuel should flow through the regulator housing when you operate the primary bulb. Check that no metal filings are present on the pressure regulator filter. If you find filings, bright yellow metal particles, the high pressure pump must be replaced. Connect two hook clips to the pressure regulator terminals. On the Delphi 1.5 DCI high pressure pumps, the resistance of the pressure regulator must be about 5 ohms. If the resistance is equal to 0 ohm, the two hook clips are probably in short circuit. Reposition them to have a resistance greater than 0 ohm. To test the operation of the solenoid valve, connect the two wires of the multimeter to the plus and minus terminals of the battery. The pressure regulator is a closing contact, normally open. When the pressure regulator is powered, the closing valve must move. This pressure regulator works perfectly, 